Hello. Today I am going to show you five different ways to remove video from a GoPro Hero camera because the original method that was designed by the factory sometimes falters. However, that method is quite simple. You plug the camera cord into the camera take the other end and plug the USB port into the USB port on the computer at which point a screen should pop up on your computer and in that screen is a file called DCIM David Charlie Indigo Michael open up the DCIM folder and then copy and paste those video files to your video files in your computer. That's the first methodology in which the factory suggests that you remove the files. However, after two months of use, my Hero camera has faulted on that method. So at that point, you have another option by taking out the SD card. Taking the SD card out of the side of the camera, placing it into your computer SD card reader, and downloading the files off of your SD card. Now I have a 32-bit SD card and it holds enough video for me to make a day's videos. However, the third method, in case you don't decide to do it like that, is you go into your computer and you go into your documents and in your documents I find it easiest if you make a list in the documents and I'll show you that right now I will show you where the list is and then you can open up the file that once again says SDCIM so I'm going to my documents and I'm going down to my DCIM folder which is right near the cursor and I'm going to open up this file and you're going to see a file that says GoPro on here. These should be the files that downloaded automatically to the computer when you plugged in the cord. So when I open this up, these files are files from last week because the file upload was not successful. The computer did not read the file. So what we have to do now is close out this window of the documents and then we're going to go to my computer. When I go to my computer, when I go to my computer, at the bottom of the list is removable disk O. O as in Oscar. That's what my GoPro Hero camera reads as. O. So then I double click on that file and I will have my DCIM file folder up at the top left hand corner. When I open this, these are today's videos. At this point, what you do is you grab by copying these video files you copy them, minimize the screen. You don't want to cut them in case you lose them in transit. Then I open up once again my documents and when my documents becomes open I find the file that says videos down here towards the bottom. I open up my video folder and I go to my designated GoPro file folder which is called Asawa videos. I double click on that file, I scroll down to the bottom of my files and I put the cursor in an empty spot and right click on the empty spot and press paste. And what will happen is these files will now paste into the computer. And while they're pasting into the computer, I will tell you that I don't know why the GoPro Hero 2 functionality fluctuates from one day it will read the files and one day it won't. 
but this is the five different methodologies in which to retrieve your GoPro videos. And I want to thank you very much for watching this tutorial by Michael Fazio in the Florida Keys. And if you have any questions, feel free to write me a PM or leave a note on this video and I will get back with you ASAP. Thank you very much and have a safe New Year's 2012.